And we are back with another edition of Monday Night Dynamite. I am the Jam Song. With me, as always, is my partner, Brock Redhead. How you doing tonight, Brock? Amazing. Um, last week, um, Serena Deeb uh, beat Sheeta, so that made me happy. Um, Hook beat Miro. That was disappointing to me. Um, but, um, yeah, that's about it, man. Deeb and... The Hulk match were the only two that really, really hit me. But um, how are you doing week two? Uh, I'm doing all right. Looking forward to the end of this uh, chaos and uh, hopefully better uh, better performance uh, in the 2K22 sphere. We'll see how that goes. Uh, I mean, this is the last month. There's only three more weeks to go until our biggest show of the summer. Or, well, in our case, it'll be in the summer, but... <laughs> <laughs> WrestleMania! Exactly, WrestleMania. Oh, my so, lord. Uh, yeah, but tonight, like, just leading things up, there's a there's a couple interesting things that we do need to address. Uh, first, uh, well, the first match is going to be Abdon versus uh, the Bunny. Last week, Rebel uh, won a Fatal 4-Way to qualify for the TBS... Uh, championship match at uh, WrestleMania. Mm-hmm. It's going to be a final five match. So the champion, the current champion, who is uh, Red Velvet plus uh, Rebel plus the winner of this match and each match for the next two weeks, there's also going to be a women's match and those women will qualify for that f- uh, final five match. That's a, an elimination five person uh, type of scenario. So that will be really interesting. Uh, we're also having uh, Ruby Soho has challenged Serena Deeb uh, yeah. for that opportunity that she won last week against Sheeta, uh, mm-hmm. or that she clarified that she still deserved. Uh, so if Soho beats Deeb, she'll be the number one contender and will face Sheeta uh, in week four before the pay per view. Uh, Perfect. And uh, yeah, that's it. That, those are the major callouts for the for this week. Also, match five, um, I decided to do a mixture. It's what I call a love hate match because uh, okay. we're gonna have Jake Hager in there, who you love, versus yep. Orange Cassidy and Downhausen. So two people you oh don't my, like. Why one guy you do. do <laughs> I just thought it'd be an interesting main event. It's all. I swear to God. I swear to God, if Hager. Gets pinned or he gets his ass beat. I'm gonna call shenanigans in sake of Jericho. Well, keep in mind that regardless, Jericho has decreed that all of his uh, stablemates in the Jericho Appreciation Society will have uh, championship matches. So already booked for uh, for WrestleMania, we're gonna have uh, 2.0 versus the Young Bucks. We're going to have Jake Hager versus Hook. Uh, we're gonna have. Uh, uh, Daniel Garcia versus Keith Lee for that FTW championship. And of course, Jericho uh, utilizing Jake. Damn, what a good move. Uh, utilizing uh, Jake Hager's uh, opportunity that he won from the Royal Rumble to go after Adam Cole's world title. Beautiful. It sounds like a stacked uh, card on your side. Uh, it has to be, man. It's the greatest show of the of the year. Ooh, Abaddon. Nice. Combination. Beautiful. Yeah, you wouldn't expect someone looking like that to be quite that athletic. Right? Oh, it makes you w- wonder how truly flexible she is. Indeed. <laughs> Ooh, there you go. Pounding her into the canvas. Like so most you... people would like to do. <laughs> so, oh, oh, hey, oh. So, without revealing major plans for season three, because I have a lot of plans that I want to see happen, but of course we don't we don't rig it, we don't do nothing, we let the computer control it and everything. Unfortunately, so sometimes, yeah, yeah, seriously. So, fresh in your mind, who are you hoping is uh, somewhat of a star in season three? Um, well, oh, that's a, a good question, really. I'd like to see more Darby. I think Darby's okay. been a little underrated. I'd yeah. love to see Kenny Omega come back and, and make a real comeback of it. Right, because we know that w- with you, you 
you don't use them unless they're actually close to becoming back or or they are back. So yeah. Exactly. So yes. unfortunately, like the start of season three, we're not gonna see Kenny Omega or CM Punk. Correct. Possibly not even see Daniel Bryan because even he was injured too. Uh, yeah, what happened with that? He got his foot stuck in the ramp? Yeah, yeah, like right to where his knee was. Jesus. Yeah, it was uh, not very well put together. And then it took like the whole crew to kind of pull the ring enough that he could get his leg free. Damn. You know who I want to see uh, soar high in season three? This is a callback to the beginning of season two, but I would love to see Sean Spears. True. True. You, you, You pushed him so hard to be a champion but he but he of course because the computer controls it <laughs> he wasn't fucking doing his job and you know if you're not going to do your job we're not going to use you as much and exactly uh, that's one of the things that I find the, the weirdest about this game is like you could have somebody with an overall of 79 against somebody with a 92 and the fucking 79 wins yes like, what yes <laughs> I tested that with um uh uh, with 2K22, I tested it with Dolph Ziggler, who's like an 80, and I tested it with Brock Lesnar, who was a 92, and I did like a th- uh, best three of four match or whatever, and Dolph took all fucking three matches. What? <sighs> uh, and Yeah, dude, and I'm like, the fuck? I mean, I, I guess because I'm trying to push Brock like like he's like he was in uh, the Ruthless Aggression Era, where yeah, he was destroyer. somewhat of a dominant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And with Dolph being like, yeah, no, sit the fuck back down. Like, I'm like, fuck. <laughs> but, but of course, we aren't ones to to adjust overall or nothing. So I wonder how bad Brock is going to do in season three. I don't know, man. I don't know. It's it's one of those things, man, that's just really... We'll have to wait and you... see and hope that things work out the way that they're supposed to. Yep. Nice. There you go. Abaddon taking her to her limits, going for that cover. One, two, only a two count. And for the women's division, I hope Soho soars high in season three. That's actually someone that I would love to see pushed more in season three is uh, Ruby yeah. Soho. So I agree with you on that one. Uh, like I said, Kenny Omega, if he comes back for sure, I want to give a really big push. I'll give Sean Spears another shot, too, if he can do it. Yep. Um, and again, if you're on a streak of like, if you're on a losing streak of like four or five weeks, then I mean, come on now. Yeah, and I, I like I wanted to give Miro a really good push too. Yes, God's favorite champion. Well, like I said, it's up to the fucking computer, right? That's what's been screwing screwing him so far. Yep. <laughs> I mean, look at last week. He was against Hook. He should have destroyed Hook. Yep. <sighs> yep. Yeah. That was the whole idea that I put him in that match was for Miro to win, not to win the championship because he didn't challenge for the title, but to right. like put him through the ringer before the the pay per view. Yep. Oh, bunny! Oh, two more. That's what I can say. So I've been using two K twenty two for a little bit now. I will say when they punch too early, there it is. There it is. They don't do that in 2K22. They don't punch too early, and if they do, they instantly react right after uh, they're done with the little loading. Uh, Good. Yeah, so then when they pick up the weapon, they don't drop it immediately like they do in 2K20. Oh, that's so frustrating. Yes. What about the in and outs, where they get in and then get out and get they, in and then get out? Um, I haven't seen that. I know that they... That they, they usually run in at seven um but i've not seen a double count out yet but they are more outside ring aware and or someone that yet- walks to the fucking t- to to the table and just keeps walking and walking and walking yeah. like they're stunned yeah like i haven't seen that yet good because some uh, of that bullshit pisses me off man oh yeah Here is your winner, oh also also, so you'll find uh, in TNA. Um, spoiler. So we're so we're using two K twenty two for the final month for TNA to sort of see how it works. 
Mm -hmm. and um, they are more ring aware when it comes to outside opponents. Like they will attack the opponents before they start attacking the current superstar in the ring when it comes to tag team matches. Nice. So if they get their pin bro broke broken up, they will go after the tag team partner and then they'll roll out and then they will go back to attacking their uh their downed opponent. Very nice. So, Look yeah, forward so, to seeing that. Awesome. What is this? This is Brian Pillman going up against Wheeler Yuta versus Wardlow versus Sean Spears in a table match. Hey, we were just speaking about that guy. I know. The irony, man, is uh, is not lost on me. <laughs> okay, so 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 who? Okay, so hold on. Wardlow. It's, this is a Fatal 4-Way, right? Yep. Fatal 4-Way okay. table match. Spears versus who? Uh, Pillman and Yuda. Pillman versus... So who's Yuda? You, you haven't used him. At all. No, he he's kind of uh, like he's only been around probably in the past six months or so uh, in real life. AEW, okay. he was hanging out with the best friends for a while, and then he got recruited by uh, Daniel Bryan and uh, John Moxley for the Black oh. Fi- uh, Blackpool Combat Club. Oh, okay, now I know what you're talking about. Sean Spears. Right, so with, with this, I'm gonna go against my pick for uh, the varsity for for the varsity blondes. I'm gonna go against it, against Pillman, and um, I'm gonna go with Spears. I want You're Spears pick to win this. Spears in a table match. Yeah. He's the chairman, though. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. But listen, I, I was hyping Spears up at dur- dur- during your first match, so I think it would be ironic if I don't choose Spears to win this match. Yeah. I mean, I would, I, I would like to see Wardlow win myself personally. Right. I don't think that's going to happen, but that's what I would like to see happen. Just because he's gone through a lot of bullshit, uh, and he's still the cross brand champion. Like when we were doing our cross brand matches. Yeah. He beat Roman Reigns. Oh uh, yeah, let's uh, forget about that. <laughs> <laughs> I will never forget about that. <laughs> Man, I can't believe Sean Spears is really sticking it to Wardlow on the outside. I wonder if he can keep up the momentum. Ooh. Oh, nice. Nice, Pillman. Airplane spin. Yep. Blam. Drop. Yeah, I think it'd be weird if I'm like, yeah, I hope that Spears, you know, soars high and sees sees in three. But right now, yeah, fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that's kind of how I feel. Oh. Ooh, some chops. Ooh, Spears. Yeah, oh, we'll switcheroo. Shit. Now we got Spears working with Pillman. Wardlow and Yuta. Ooh. Nice. Yuta showing some uh, some interesting offense on the outside. Yep. But it is Wardlow. a tables match. They need to put their opponent through a table. So. I wonder if the curse of the tape, table and chair is uh, apparent in season three. We'll we'll have to wait and see. Ooh. Oh, okay. oh, I thought he was gonna plant him through that table. Spears, Spears. If I've put oh. any faith in you, right now is the most important match of season two for you. Fucking get this victory. Oh, he should run and grab Wardlow and do a superplex right through the table. But no. Come on, come on, Spears. Put him in the corner. No, the corner, dummy. Ugh. Come on, Spears, don't fuck me! Leg drop. Boom. Oh, never mind. I swear to God, Spears is the one that loses this and goes through the table. I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> okay, pick Ooh. him up. Yes. Oh! Yes. Drop him! No! Oh, wrong direction. Spears. Spears, he's right there. 
Zemiris, watch out! There's a fucking brick wall behind you. Now the brick wall is fighting back! It's unbelievable! Yeah, you can't put Ooh, someone nice. through a table if the table ain't set up. I mean, okay, okay, what if the table collapses, but then say you do suplex somebody on top of it, and it does, by chance, break the table in half? Does that still count? It should. It's like Spears. someone has to go through the table, that's the only rule. Oh. I mean, technically, if you jumped off of the top rope and you went through the table and eliminated yourself, you would have lo uh, you would have lost. Yep. But I don't know who would be the winner in that case. I guess yourself. You win and lose. <laughs> <laughs> God, Spears, Spears, Spears. Ooh, Jesus Christ. So I came across something on Facebook, and it says, if Ric Flair is in the woods, no, if Ric Flair is in the forest and he chops, and he chops down a tree and says woo, does the world still hear it? Well, of course, because Ric Flair would make sure the world heard it. <laughs> He'd have someone there to record it, and upload Ooh. it to the internet for all time. And speaking of Ric Flair, the wedding of... Uh of uh, Andrade and uh, Charlotte was uh, looked uh, amazing. Mm. Oh, damn. Like I said, I'm not a big Flair fan. No, but you know that there was a bunch of Flair at that fucking wedding. Oh, yeah. A lot of wooing going on. <gasps> Woo! If, she, if, if when they shared their first kiss and she didn't woo right after, then I'm glad I didn't go. <laughs> yeah, thank goodness we didn't go. <laughs> Not like Spears. we were on the invitation list. Oh, Spears! 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 Spears. 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 Drop him! Right Drop him right through the tape! He yes. missed it. Oh my. Spears, I swear to God, if you. You know what? You know what? I'm going to be kind. Maybe the world needs me to be nice. Oh. All right, now get Pillman up there and superplex him through. Oh, nice. Spears, pay attention to your, your surroundings. No! Blammo. Nice hesitation, nice hesitation. Oh, that's got to hurt. Oh, yes! Okay. Yes. Now, now, now focus on somebody in the ring. Don't you dare get out. Oh, what a Spears. bad timing for him to get out of the ring. Yuta. Spears. Taking it away with authority. <laughs> Spears on the outside like, damn it. <laughs> well, the curse of Brock is <laughs> still, still in effect. Who are you going to pick for the next match? <laughs> Spears, you're making it really hard for me to root for you in Season 3. Spears, you're making it really fucking hard for me. That's what she said. Hey, yo. Oh. Hey, Matt. Yep. Ditch to eat a cookie crumbles, my friend. So up next, a rematch from last week. We're going to see the best friends going up against LAX again. Perfect. Yeah, I was going to try to let the, the computer book most of the rest of this season, and I ended up not doing that. <laughs> but this, <laughs> this one was one that the computer picked, so. Right. Damn.
fucking spears. Yep. Why does the world why why does the world Jericho me? Like constantly. I don't know, man. Maybe you just got a Jericho y type of face. I don't want to have a Jericho y type of face. It's it's something you're born with, I'm afraid. It's not something you can control, it just happens. Damn it. And you just let it happen. Yeah, why not? It's good for business. No, it's not. It's terrible for business. It's doing great for my business. Look at my ratings. Well, you know what? When I transition to Mondays, the ratings are going to stay. And we'll see. It'll be amazing. We'll see. Only time will tell, my friend. Huh? Santana Ortiz about to get jumped by the best friends on the outside. Ooh, nice. The, re- the bell hasn't even rung yet. No, it has not. And there's a ref there calling for the bell. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Trent Beretta really laying out his opponent. Is L is LAX coming back for season three or no? Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Woo. So is best friends. So are Jurassic. So are uh, the Lucha Brothers and uh, Young Bucks. Now, did you find a good uh, 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 Jurassic Express? I think so. It's been a while since I've. Oh, excuse me. It's been a while since I've loaded it up to see who I downloaded because I decided to to wait further until everything comes out before I do anything else because I don't want to have anything else break. <laughs> so. See, I feel like when it breaks, it's because the people have a hundred fucking down, 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 downloads with different r- renders. I feel like that's why their shit is crashing and restarting their shit because they're, they're fucking with it. Yeah, but I mean that's kind of what your what this game is supposed to be. I mean they're like, yeah, man, we gave you eighty characters. Yeah, five Triple H's, nine Mizzes. I mean, come on, fuck, man. It's like the whole purpose of this game is to have that community creations aspect, so you can get as many superstars as you need to make your universe the way you want. I mean, if I wanted to do a universe mode that is all AEW, Ring of Honor, and uh, and uh, New Japan. I can't. I, I can't get enough wrestlers to cover all three shows. Mm-hmm. I feel you. And on even that. even if I could, you're probably gonna fucking break it because it takes like nine hours to load into a fucking match. Right. Uh oh. Rut row. There it is. Whoop! Indeed. Jesus Christ. No, it's Jim. Uh, it's Jim, so, man. I know <laughs> we, we get confused sometimes, but I cut that hair. I shaved my beard. Looking a little less like a messiah. I hate you. It's a love hate relationship, man. You love to hate me. <laughs> we're like. We're like woods and uh, breeze. It's 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 we love each other, but when it comes to this, speaking of woods and breeze, did you see the last uh, the last uh, GM mode? I Battle think of the so. Brands? Did you see what Breeze did? He he he, he did what you could never do. When we were talking what? about who the A show was, and 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 uh, Breeze was like, no, Raw is the A show, and then uh, Woods went. You're right. Smackdown's the B show. B for the best. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> the world just hates me. You're just not as fast as Woods, that's all. No, because if I had said that, then you would have come I'm... you would have come back with something. Yeah, B for bullshit. <laughs> yeah. Like, I can't win. Still. You know, it would have been it would have been neat for you to have come up with something like that. At least then it'd be a little bit more of a fair fight. 
I mean, I do come up with all my SmackDown ideas. <laughs> like the I Dead mean, Poets Society? Yeah, l like that. Um, no, uh, put, put, putting uh, M MJF in the Better Than Utopia. That was all the... Um, yeah, look at how that turned out. <laughs> um... Putting the Dead Poets Society with Daniel Bryan, that was my idea. No, that was my um, idea. Um, 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 you know, all the great ideas are my ideas. <laughs> you know, putting crazy, crazy Steve with, with Kazardi was 100% me. <laughs> Yeah, uh, yeah. I, I, I don't remember mentioning to you that that would be a good idea before you even knew who Crazy Steve was. I so knew who Steve was. <laughs> You're like, well, really? Who's who's Crazy Steve? Who? <laughs> I don't know who he is. Why would he be good with Kazarni? Because their gimmick <laughs> is the same. That's why. Uh, Kiz is not a gimmick. It's a lifestyle, sir. Eh, gimmick, lifestyle, same deal. Lifestyle is just a gimmick that you don't give up. Oh, damn. It's not a phase, Mom. It's not a phase, Mom. It's a gimmick. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, we're at four. Ooh. Slamming him into those chair uh, ta little uh, stairs. Oh, I fixed it. I fixed it. I was broken, and now I'm fixed. It's all good. I'm not gonna lie to you. If you, you better not, motherfucker. If you were to allow, the, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. If 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 Matt Hardy ever came back to WWE, which I doubt he will, you know what attire I would assign him? Oh, a draw. And I'm telling you one thing because it's the last month. We're not fucking. We're gonna let it be a draw. I don't give a shit. Uh, now, what were you saying about a Matt Hardy attire? attire? Like. If Matt Hardy ever came back to WWE and I were to use him in season three, do you know what attire I would probably stick on him? The broken Hardy attire? Yes, yes, those tights that he wore with the key and shit. Uh, probably. Probably. Yeah, I always dug the, the broken Hardy. I didn't think that he got enough of a a good run in WWE with that gimmick. Yeah. Then his Pay pay per view attire would be his uh, V one Matt Hardy. Yep. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh Soho. Yeah, this is the one I was telling you about. This is a Soho's opportunity to steal that number one contendership away from Serena Deeb. That's right. So I'm gonna win this match no matter what the outcome is. It's true, because they're two superstars that you enjoy, so either way, you're good to go. Better off the bat. Yeah, going straight for that cover. Got a one count, though. Well, yeah, because it's straight off the bat. It's like not like she did enough damage to really... Oh, no, but if it was off the bat and they didn't do much, then I wouldn't think that the count would happen, but she got a one count. Yeah. So like hope. she do... Yes. Ooh, com oh, I thought she was going for a neckbreaker combination. Ooh, early one. Okay, not bad. No! She's getting this party started. Yes, sir. So ho. Pwah! Nice. Ooh, nice fireman's carry. She can fireman's carry you anytime. Oh, hey -o. hey -o. Nice. Hold on. Nice, nice, baby. Do, 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 do. Okay. Ooh, there's a lot of covers in this match. That's it. They both desperately want that number one contendership. They're both desperately trying to impress me, and you know, desperately I, seeking Soho. My my approval is high. 
high, high on the leaderboard. So, you know, I am, you know. It's unbelievable. Ooh, a kick to the guts, Deeb. Bam! Taking her nice. down. More kicks and stomps and drilling her in the back. Ooh! Ooh! Sneaky kick. Yep. Catch her! Boom! Nice! Huge reversal. I'm gonna still try to work her in the ropes in the corner. Now going for that choke. There you go, you can choke me anytime. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing as how I have a thing for Soho, Liv, and Ruby, I think I think I might have a type. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I might have a wrestling type. Yeah, but you also like uh, Rhea. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Soho. Wait, who would I say? You said Deeb, Soho, and oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> yeah, Rhea, Soho, and Liv. Well, even deep to a degree. I mean, those dark leather pants. Ooh. She looks a little bit like a dominatrix. Ooh. Oh, Deeb nice. almost, almost tapped out. Was able to fight out of it. I'm a man who likes strong, independent women. Just like spit in Mickey your mouth Jake. and call you a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's worthless. It's oh, worthless. Spit in my That's mouth right. and call me worth Yeah. But no. And, it's like, uh, reform my beliefs in myself. <laughs> <laughs> like Mickey with those strong legs. Jesus mm. Christ. See, when I was in high school, my, my, my thing was uh, the volleyball player body. Like, mm. you're, like, strong in the hips and legs and... Sh oof. Damn. Yeah, you know, my team is very confusing. Like, I need I need someone to bang my balls. That's all. <laughs> uh, spear. Oh, is she going spear. for it? Oh, yeah. did not get all of it though. No. Only a two count. Oh, we gotta come back. Come back for Ruby. One, two, oh! That's another thing too. If they're close to the close to the ropes, they'll they'll in two K twenty two. If they're close to the ropes, and they will grab it with their arm or their foot. Wow! Hey. Soho super kick taking it. Perfect. So Soho will face Sheeta on uh, week four for that. That's uh, AEW Women's Championship. And then the winner of that match will go on to face Britt Baker at West Re blah, WrestleMania. Are you okay? I'm not sure. Well, I bit my lip while I was eating, so it's kind of throwing off my... Oh, tongue. damn. The worst is when you bite your tongue and you keep oh, doing it. Yeah, or the side of your cheek. Yes, and then oh. it's like right there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the side of your cheek's the worst because you're like, how did that even happen? Yep. It's not close to my teeth. I had to, like, move my jaw to the side to pinch it, you know? Yep. So Soho, moving on. She's finally getting some of the respect that she, she deserves, man. Damn right. Looking forward to in two weeks' time when she goes on one-on-one -on -one with Sheeta. Oh, if I'm not mistaken, this is our main event. It is! It is the main event. Jake Hager God. against Orange Cassidy against 
Dan Housen. I feel like for me, this is a two on one match, and I'm not happy about it. No, it isn't really because it's still a triple threat. It's in my moves. eyes, this is a two on one match. Two well, people. go to the optometrist, man, because you need your eyes fixed. So my ears and now my eyes. Man, you got to go see an ears, eyes, nose, throat specialist. I'm <laughs> my throat spec. My throat is for Ray Ripley. <laughs> well, like, there you go. That's why you got to get cleared by the specialist to make sure there's <sighs> nothing wrong in there. <laughs> All right. So who are you picking in this match? Um, I want to pick Jake Hager. I'd love to see him win. Actually, ah, uh, we agree. Sometimes it's one of those. It's like an eclipse, right? It happens every once in a few years. Wow. Nice. Drop him on his neck. No, Hager. God damn it. Okay, let these two fight it out. Hager, pick him up. Yes. Ooh. On the rope. On the rope. No. Why would you let him push you like that? Get the fuck out of here, Hager. All right, Hager, get up. There you go. Let these two <laughs> dumbasses fight. Yeah, Hager, get up. <laughs> I was waiting to see what you were going to call. <laughs> oh. Nice. Huge there kick from Dan Housen. Hager just no. saying out to the side. Oh, Dan Housen going, no, nope. I got to go after the bigger threat. Don't interfere. Let these let them fight. Let them fight. Let them fight. Dan Housen says he has to go after the bigger threat. Don't toss me, Jake. I put the gas on you. Damn it. I've been Dan Housen. -ed. Drop him. Must, there you go. Must put a curse on him. That's right. He's running. He's running like a scared little boy. That's like how a he gets you. Like a that, scared tangerine. That's how he gets you. Merry Christmas, motherfucker. There you go, Pin! How are you going to let him lift you like that? Very carefully. I was about to say, Dan, if you give a fucking two count. Dude, I'm pissed because all of season three, Dan Houser will be on my fucking roster. Eh. Not my problem. <laughs> it is your problem. You brought this shit on me. No, that was Josh's fault. <laughs> but you encouraged it by doing it first. Okay. Eh, whatever. No, it's not whatever. I'm full, I'm full of good ideas. If you don't like them, that's your problem. I, I hate them. I hate all your good ideas. You can hate whatever you want, my friend. Good. I will not stop your hatred. Good. I hope Better. You know Best. What? You know what? I hope every time in season three... Josh has me put Dan Housen right in a match, and Dan Housen wins. I hope every morning that you wake up, you stub your pinky toe on the on Dan on Housen the bed. Yes, yes. <laughs> every time Dan Housen wins for season three for, for Ring of Honor, I hope you wake up the next day and you stub your pinky toe at least nah, once. I'll just yeah. wear steel toe and, and steel toe slippers. Then Every time it happens, you go, oh, Dan Housen won. He cursed me. I put that curse on you, yes. I put that curse on you. Ooh. Oh. No, why Kendo would you to the head, going for the cover. If you give him a two count. Not Ooh. even a two count. Fucking Jake, what are you doing? Come on, Hager, pick him up. Oh, he missed the kick. He missed the big boot. Oh, here we go. Nice. Oh, I thought it was Hager getting a move off on that one. <laughs> Whoop. There it is, folks. Nope. Nope. Yes, it is. Nope. 
Why are you ro Okay, good. Oh! You've been orange juiced. Snap his spine! Come on, Hager, you can do it. Hager, snap it. Oh! OJ is getting out of it. Takes this him down. Ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Boom! Another Why? stunner. Why? Oh, he misses take, the kendo. Take, 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 take. Use there it. you Use go. It. Do not drop it. Use it. Do not drop it. Punish there him. Oh, but Danhausen. How are you letting him one up you right now? Yes. Oh. No. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Boom. No. Oh! Yes! 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 yes Small yes, package from Hager. One, two. Ugh. Boom! Another Why stunner. Why would you let him stun you? Dan House is like, what? <laughs> no. This is ridiculous. Well, that's what you get whenever Dan Housen is in a match. That should be a rope break. I swear to God, Hager, if you fuck me like Spears did. Ooh, you nice. just like getting fucked by big sweaty men, that's all. I knew it. <laughs> nice belly to belly. What are you going to oh, do with it? that kendo, though. Use it! He's stolen. The victory has been stolen. Hey, we're rolling out. Oh, Dan Housen. One, two, three. Well, at least Why? they didn't pin Jake Hager. <laughs> Why? He got manhandled this match. That's the way the cookie crumbles, my friend. No, that it's not. It's it not is. How the cookie it this crumbled is. all over your your friggin' lap, my friend. This is what happens when you get Jericho. You constantly you Jericho me twice. Just go get yourself a big glass of milk twice. for all those little cookie crumbs, my friend. Why this? You, you cry you, into your milk glass. You Jericho me twice tonight. Why? Jericho wasn't even in the building tonight. It's you constantly Jericho me, and I don't understand what your vendetta is against me. But I have no problem with you. It's like you have a problem with the universe. You can't accept the inevitabilities. No, because it's not supposed to happen this way. I mean, it obviously is, because that's how it happened, right? I'm just saying. Anyway, that is the main event. Thank you very much, everybody, for watching. I am the GM, so he is Brock Redhead. Links in the description. Whatever. Like, subscribe, follow, all that jazz. Whatever. Peace. Whatever.